Billionaire Charlie, man, we got a good one today, ladies and gentlemen, man. Monique, Steve Harvey, Lee Daniels, ladies and gentlemen, man. This is going to be a good one today, man. This expression and this showing y'all, man, that karma sometimes catches up with you, man. And I feel like Monique is handling this in the right way. You know what I'm saying? Amazon, ladies and gentlemen, once again, I got a lot of great items right there in my affiliate link right there below. But y'all going to be able to enjoy the news today, man. Monique is somebody that's inspired women all over the world, man. She's a great comedian. She's an Oscar-winning comedian, ladies and gentlemen, beautiful woman, beautiful wife. You know what I'm saying? A lady that gets business done, you know what I'm saying? And she's respected all over, man. Y'all go ahead and check out my YouTube channel, This Journey Called Life. And go pick up my book, Free Me From My, mom, my Wife's Book, Free Me From The Trap. Go pick that up for me, ladies and gentlemen. And go tune into our YouTube channel, This Journey Called Life. Amazon, man. We got a lot of great products right there below, man. A lot of great products right there below in my links. Uh, once again, ladies and gentlemen, man, cash tag being there, Charlie, right here. Go ahead and put in your donations, man, to support the channel, man. And once again, go check out our YouTube channel, This Journey Called Life. We here to talk about a lot of great and amazing topics, man. A lot of great and amazing topics, man. Like I, I want to tell y'all, man, I really appreciate y'all tuning in to me. I really appreciate every donation that come in. I really appreciate every item that's being purchased. And I appreciate every view that's being coming in. I, I thank you for all the subscribers, new subscribers. I definitely love you. I'm I'm a good spirited person, you know what I mean? I love people, man, and I love this great and amazing world we live in, you know what I'm saying? But like I told y'all before, man, when I talk, I like to come correct and 100% right, you know what I'm saying? I like to bring y'all great information, great products, and things of that nature, and I like for y'all to enjoy me as a person because I am a great and amazing person. But let's get into this Monique situation, man. Monique is like, she's doing things humbly and respectfully because they always tell you the energy you put back, you would get. You know what I'm saying? So being that uh, Steve Harvey then lost his show and Lee Daniels' show has been canceled, uh, Steve Harvey has been replaced on the uh, little big shots. You know what I'm saying? And um, Lee Daniels' show has been canceled. And I just feel like a lot of things that uh, Monique was saying was right. I'm going to let y'all listen to the clip in a minute. But I just feel like... Uh, Monique was right, man, by not going off and not trying to brag about somebody losing their jobs and things of that nature. I feel like uh, humbly, you just, you understand that your brothers and sisters make mistakes, you know what I mean? And we got to forgive them and move forward. And maybe they do business later and it won't be the same way. I love me some Oprah. My mom loved Oprah. Of course, my family like loved the Empire with Lee Daniels. And Steve Harvey has been a household name everywhere, in my house especially. You know what I mean? Steve Harvey is the original king of comedy. So we listen to Steve Harvey. We respect Steve Harvey. I respect Lee Daniels. I respect Tyler Perry and Oprah. But I feel like uh, Monique was right in a lot of sense. And I feel like then, even with the Netflix deal, I feel like uh, she deserved to get what she desired. I mean, that's that's what it's all about, man. We live in America, man. You know what I'm saying? This is not no no other uh, 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 country, you know what I mean, where you could be limited to your greatness. And I, Monique is great. And I love me some Monique. And I always respect her as a black queen, you know? And she got a, 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 a nice and, and beautiful husband, man, that's taking good care of her, making sure she white. She's looking 100% healthy, great. I mean, I feel like she, she really done great with her body and everything. And I feel like we should be celebrating Monique, not sitting around bashing her because she's a great and amazing sister of our culture. And we should be just showing her love, man. She deserves every penny and every dollar she's asking for. And I'm not going to go off track because Monique didn't go off track. But I would love to say some things, you know what I'm saying? But I'm not going to go that far. You know what I'm saying? I'm just going to say Monique deserved to have what she desired to have. And I don't give a care what nobody say. You know what I'm saying? Monique deserved to have what she desired. Now, we can't sit around and say, oh, Monique should have this or Monique should have that. Monique got an Oscar. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Monique then sold out so many movie theaters. Come on now. We're going we gonna to talk facts. Let's bring up numbers, man. Let's talk facts. We got to be real. Like, Monique done it already. You know what I'm saying? She's a, you know what I mean? she's, she's accomplished. You know what I mean? But anyway, I'm going to let y'all hear this clip. Tag. Mm. A, a whole lot. Yes, I have. Since Steve has gotten his show canceled and Little Big Shot and just thought it'd be a great time to speak about it in addition to uh, Lee Daniels. Yes. So we just thought that we would have, a, you know, a little conversation about it like we always do. Now, I, I, I want to kick it off. Kick it off. Okay. And the reason why I want to kick it off is because some of the memes and tags I've been getting 
has been almost celebratory. Almost? Well, have been celebratory. Well, people say, that's what his ass get. Yeah, yeah, Mo, see? Let me be clear about something. Let us be clear about something. We do not celebrate what appears to be someone else's demise. We do not stand and applaud and say, yeah, look what's happening. That's what you get. That's not where we're coming from. That's not the stance we've ever taken. So what I would ask y'all to do is we got to love our folks through it. Yeah. We got to love them through it. And I know some people would say, hey, Monique is crazy because one minute she's saying they didn't do it right, and the next minute she's saying love them through it. Let me tell you exactly what we're saying. Tell them. Steve Harvey, I've, I've considered him my friend. Now, maybe he didn't consider me his friend, but I've always considered him my friend. And as my friend, when we came out and said what was going on, it wasn't to put my friend down. It was to say, this is what it is. This is what's happening. When you've often referred to him as your brother. As my brother. When it comes to Brother Lee Daniels, I'm getting all kind of hits. That's what his ass get, Mo. Yeah, see, karma is a bitch. All of that. I don't celebrate my brother Lee Daniels getting those shows canceled. Because what I want us to think about, when those shows get canceled, I can't celebrate Lee Daniels getting canceled because so many other people are involved that lose their jobs. That some people, when they lose those jobs, there are bills that doesn't get paid. There are situations and, and things that happen because you're used to making that money and now it's being taken away. And some of us are standing up saying, yay. If we continue to do that, we'll continue to be treated the way that we're treated. Now. See, now that we see what's going on with this Monique situation, man, we got a clear picture of, man, somebody being humbling and not just bragging and boasting just because this situation happened. Now we see Monique having a lot of success now, and she's just popping out. And I, like me, man, I'm just ready for her to get another TV show and to start doing everything a lot more, man. We want to see Monique a lot more, you understand? We don't have no beef with Steve Harvey or Lee Daniels or Oprah, none of them. I got love for all of them, man, because they all part of the culture, and we got to move together and not against each other. That's my message, man. I really love me some Monique, man. I think she's a great and beautiful and wonderful woman. You know what I'm saying? Anybody that has her as a wife is is happy, you know what I'm saying, because she's beautiful. You know what I mean? She's always been a great comedy great uh, comedian at all time. You know what I'm saying? She's great, y'all. But I'm out, man. Be in there, Charlie. Love y'all.